They put something down and it splattered. That's water. No, 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 I got concrete spots. Hey everybody, I just want to tell you something that's a little exciting. We started this pool four weeks ago, from zero to now. We're in concrete. Concrete's a big deal. Now we, we uh, will put the rest of the coping in. The, uh, the concrete that I put in is 3,500 PSI, and then I'll put rebar in it every 18 inches on center. And then if there's a footing, I'll put half inch rebar and uh, 12 inch on center. And, uh, and then we put a put a, uh, a barrier on the bottom of the concrete. This what this does is prevent the, the the water from coming up through the floor. And if you're going to do a sun decking or any kind of coating, you want to keep that bisqueen down, that that plastic. And uh, we have we have joints, expansion joints coming in, no more than eight foot apart. And uh, concrete does crack, hairline crack, uh, but we try to minimize any of it. We want them to come into the to the joints of the of the um, expansion joints, but uh, it's it's going to be strong. It's going to look great. What do you have to think about, it, Bianca? I was just going to say to all of you out there that don't know what the heck he just talked about. I bet if you talk to any concrete guy and showed him this video, they will tell you that that is some strong concrete.